Welcome back to Valkyria Chronicles. We're doing this uh, Verat story side what story. What lies beyond hate? Verat's vendetta. It's time for depth in one of the coolest characters. Alicia's not part of this. Thank you for coming, soldiers. I apologize yeah. for the lack of notice. <laughs> I've called you for a special operation. It says a lot about you, and it also says a lot about me. Yep. I'm issuing this order on my own authority. I haven't reported it. I'll bear the risk. You don't have army clearance? Why not report it, Captain? There will be no questions. Is this like a fucking comedy episode? Please tell directed. me it's not. It's not. Okay, it's like a super, like, legit serious episode. I don't remember the semantics. The enemy are what's left of the Thousand Camp. They're holed up in a house on the outskirts of the city. Your objectives are to return all hostages and capture or eliminate all Imperials. Okay. The enemy is led by a man named... Oh. Georgios Gell. Tortured and murdered Galleons in the First European War. He warrants no pity. Okay, so it's just some asshole. Georgius Geld? Bell, is this about. Prepare for deployment immediately. You are dismissed. Is it some terrible murderer? Uh, she said that he was a torturer, so I'm going with yes. Cool. The captain didn't seem like her usual self. It was almost scary. I like that over the course of the game, even Verat warms up to the sevens to the point of, like, being, like, really chummy. Like, when you first get introduced, she's just like, yeah, army, military, whatever. Yeah, uh, I'm under Damon and he's a fucking asshole, let's move on. And, like, later on, she's like, yeah, whatever, go to the beach, fucking fuck it. She's like the cool aunt that lets you sneak off during the family vacation to smoke pot. Yeah, well, I don't know about that cool, but... The enemy got Frederick one day. Word is, the enemy captain tortured him to death. Gross. That enemy captain was Georgios Geld. That's a good, like, asshole villain name. Georgios Geld. Yeah. The war ended, she stayed on. He sounds like a Gundam villain. My guess is, it was just for a chance at revenge. Are you okay? I'm fine. That's terrible. Welkin, are you implying that war's bad? Because this so far this game's led me to think that war is great. Everything's got watercolors and cell shading, and there's a nice vignette that implies that we're all just paper. In the pages of history. Those imp cowards have taken Whoa man, even this is fucking description. Yeah, well it's her description. I know. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Like normally she's very like straight neutral, and neutral and about it. About it's it. like she's it's like, a those job, imp whatever. Cowards. Have taken civilian hostages and hold up inside a private residence. Squad 7 will enter the site from this point. And murder those punks. You can't let them see you coming this time. If they spot you, those hostages are dead. Begin by making your way into the building undetected. If you don't stay hidden in the grass, they'll spot you. Complete your approach. Take down all the lookouts at once. Ah! Objective- Ah! Am I clear? When you stop moving, stay hidden in the grass. If you're seen, kill them before they can- uh, before the phase ends. Once the coast is clear, you enter the residence. Free those hostages, disarm the hostiles inside, and hold them. They'll be participating here as a foot soldier. No tank. Which means you won't be able to issue orders for this mission. Which doesn't really matter anyway. Okay. Position your units. That's right, you can't afford to get any of your units spotted in this mission. That said, start off by moving Welkin forward along the upper path, which I believe is the left-hand side. Should I just bring scouts? It doesn't say... I'll bring a shock trooper. Just in case. Just in case. Deploy! It looks like it's just a relatively short one. It's got slightly more dialogue than the previous, but it's still not a lot. Right. Once again, all of the dialogue fits snugly on my phone at 12... At, uh, oh, he looks like the evilest guy ever. He's got an inverted Hitler... Mustache, I mean. I'm getting you bad today. So it's a regular mustache. Yes. men are hiding in that house. There are patrols monitoring the perimeter. Be careful. You have a problem with calling a regular mustache the inverted Hitler? Although I guess technically that would be a beard as well. Leave even one and Geld will know we're here. Unbelievable. Those are your orders. Failure is not an option. Oh man, she's super into it. You have two moves. So yeah, move Welkin up to the left side path. That's rule that's set number one. It clearly, it says Welkin, but I think as long as it's 
the first as long as it's a scout i think it'll be fine are you for real? Majima. Bakana. Sunna. How far up can I take? Along the upper path all the way to the end near the tree and the fence. So literally where you were just standing. Oh, but there's another tree and fence set up here, so that works too, I guess. Nobody Somebody saw you. Whoa. Somebody saw me? No. You saw someone else. Tab? Nope, nothing. You still have another move after this, too. What's next? Eliminate the scout on the roof on the, uh, of the house directly across from your position. So I there he is. This is going to be really awkward because your accuracy is not great. Move back to the right. There you go. Don't miss. Oh, thank God. So many yeah, shots. That's all of my actions. Yes. Well, that's also only the first turn. Really? Enemy sighted. Yes. Jesus. All right. And the turn. So the next move is going to be completely dedicated to moving people Man low. Down, sir. Uh oh. Uh oh. My, my. There's nothing for it. Oh! Wow. Wow, that's really unforgiving. Retry battle. Shock troopers are useless. Shock troopers are useless. Yes, yes, we know. You're evil. Eyes plugging out like that and they actually look pretty scary. Uh, pick free, see if she can go further. That's the reason we didn't have a good line of sight the first time around. Was because we didn't have our person in position one actually get the, the shots, uh, like, or because Welkin was dancing around because he was stuck on Freesia when we started. Yep. Tap it a tap tap. Come on. Hey. Alright, what's next in that walkthrough? Next uh, partner. lay down in the grass and immediately switch over to your next person. Don't let anyone see you. Okay. Then follow the path on the right-hand side and take out the guy, one of the guys around the side of the house. Let's go, Juno. Juno? Yeah. Low path. And then hit the grass. Remember, there's a guy right over the hill. At least there should be. There are two more scout elites positioned just around the corner of the house. Take both of them out and complete the mission. I'm assuming it wants you to end your turn here. Because we only have three moves. I mean two moves in one turn. Yeah. So unless this turn starts and they immediately go, Hey, one of our guys just got killed. Like that. Are you fucking serious right now? We didn't, nobody saw us though. So it's a one turn thing. I guess so. Or alternatively, we need to go back to the briefing and explicitly bring people that give us more moves. One awkward cut later. Okay, we're back in and we have actual, um, like, normal amounts of turns capable. So instead of the game just being like, oh yeah, you have two moves and one turn to kill three people, now we actually have the right amount. Yeah, this walkthrough from IGN, not, uh, not super clear. Gus like, Gus like, Gus like. My left foot. Time for a quick step. Please head for the objective. Also, the only reason why I'm not talking right now is because I got super pissed off at this goddamn mission. For obvious reasons. Yeah, that's an understandably frustrating bit of, like, hey, guess what? You're, a, like, the thing you're struggling with? It's stupid shut up. 
Yeah, that was some petty shit. Did you already kill the second guy, or no, not yet? This is the second okay. guy. Okay. I thought she was gonna, like, actually mess up the whole mission. Seriously. And then supposedly there's areas. So yeah, straight up, it's just bring your bring your your ca your cannon squad, and then use all your moves to do this in one turn. That go. wasn't made particularly clear. It's just so much responsibility. Don't you dare mess this up. I said to Freesia and not you. That was really dumb, and actually super frustrating. But guess what? It's over now. Thankfully, these missions are not terribly overwhelming. Yeah. yeah. Just it wasn't clear. Galleon attack. When did you? It's all over, Geld. Your miserable life ends here. Geld looks so fucking evil. A lot of symbols are in missions. Let's see what happens. So this is Georgios Geld. Taking civilian prisoners violates treaty law, does it not? He killed her family. Please forgive me. No, it was for Frederick, their friend from the from the first again. war. That's all. Did you I miss that? Yes. Okay. Yeah, uh, Largo true. covered it, explaining that they had a friend called Frederick, and this Silence. guy tortured him to death. Who believe the words of scum like you? I've no doubt you'd slaughter them all. Your evil won't go unpunished. You are hereby sentenced to death uh -oh. by firing squad. Nah, throw him in jail instead. But Captain Verat, prisoners of war have a right to a formal trial. You can't just. I can and will. I'll kill him myself if She's I. She's like, hey, this mission's I'll off the books. <laughs> she said that. I know she okay. did. Okay, I was like, dude, you don't even know, but you do know. If you do this, you'll be discharged from the militia, Captain. And what of it? I've lived for the day I end this man's life. I can respect that. It's yeah, all right. I can do for Frederick now. Same. There's nothing else left. Damn! I love the arms off off screen. Because it was like super rigid too. It was just whap. Yeah, it was like you could put comedic sound effects on it. If you if you like took the took the screen that uh of that just Verat, that no that Verat's in right now and expanded it, you would have seen fucking Largo's T pose fucking spinning around like a Beyblade. You are super right. That's probably what they did. This is T pose. Whap. That looked Torture. super awkward and weird. Doesn't that make you angry? Of course it does, El. I could wring the rat bastard's neck myself. But do you think Frederick would want that? Think he'd want you to bloody your hands? Fucking, she shoots him and then shoots herself, and everyone's like, "What the fuck?" Back then, us three were always talking about how we'd build a peaceful Galia. Frederick's gone. But I know he'd still want that, even now. Peace on Earth. Marco. You didn't stick around the force this long just to take revenge, Jill. Or did you? You stayed for. <laughs> She's like, yeah, and just pops the guy right there. <laughs> oh, onomatopoeia for crying is always really awkward. <laughs> don't, don't cry. If you'll have me. Oh god damn it. They hey. fucking ship super hard, don't they? Forever. God damn it. OTP. Are you fucking serious? OTP. Uh. Watch that watch those cinematics and then the episode will will end at a very normal time. Oh hey, it's that place that didn't blow up yet. <laughs> Finally back in friendly territory. Again. Is this a flashback? That could No, Rangrees is a prison. I think. It's a military fortress, all the same. Okay. Which they're not in control of at the moment. Identify yourself. Captain Georgius Geld. I was there we go. as part of a prisoner exchange. So you're Geld, are you? I hear you took non darkson civilians as well. Non darkson Specifically. That was after serving time for abuse of captives in the first European War, correct? Yes, but that was a long time ago, and... Lord Commander Maximilian is a strict man on protocol. You've roused quite a fire in him. You're to be court-martialed forthwith. 
Brace yourself for the worst. Oh, well, at least he gets his come up. I like that even the Empire has no, got stuff in place of like, if you're a, if you're like an immoral jackass, we're still gonna get you in trouble. Stop. No, let me go. No, I, I don't want to die. This can't really. I don't want to die. Tough. You're a shitty person. You deserve it. You deserve it. And some people might say that's a fucked up thing to say. My answer is, so? <laughs> Marco, well done. Has everything I've done up to now been a mistake? Yeah. Watch him just be really dismissive, like, and yeah, you fucked up. Yeah, actually, and he pushes her off the cliff. Oh, jeez. Avenging his death. But, it's like you said, killing that man won't bring Frederick back. You could drill break her. So we can't get Frederick back, but we're still gonna have to live our lives. Hmm? Know what I think? We've gotta live our lives the best we possibly can. You ask me, part of that How means old bringing is Largo? peace back to Gallia. Old enough to have That's been in the first war, so I'm, I'm assuming mid-40s. Hmm. I know! How Veg we oh my fucking garden? god! Vegetables taste good, look good. And they're good for you. We're gonna make Gallia one big farm. Marco's such a fucking <laughs> dork. What? <laughs> What's so funny? I just pictured Gallia as this giant pumpkin patch. It's too funny. Why laughing? I love the dub for this. Usually yeah. dubs are like awkward and kind of shitty, but every once in a while you get a really good one. My back for me. That's the only reason I've made it this far. It's really good. Shut up. Margo, thank you. Sure. I didn't even have to say anything. Yeah. We want to talk good dubs. Full Metal Look Alchemist. Look at this. Just what's going on here? Hey, we're just... That is, uh... <clears throat> well, well, Largo. Who would have You think Largo and Reinhardt would be Guess friends? What? They would absolutely be friends. <laughs> That's quite enough. The hostages were all recovered safely. Mostly thanks to your squad's efforts. Your orders are to return to the capital as soon as possible. That's all. Dismissed. Captain. Captain. Dude, I would sell my soul to Blizzard forever if they did a crossover with Valkyria Chronicles. They wouldn't. They no, they never would. That's crazy. But dude, I'd be so into that. I know you would, buddy. Well, anyway, thanks for watching Valkyria Chronicles. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and follow us on all our social media channels, and don't forget to hit that little bell. And also don't forget, if you're gonna kill all three of the guards outside, you do it in one turn. Yeah. Next time... Do we have one more? We have one more. We have a Welkin mission to do, and then it's the last mission in the game, and the LP ends. We'll see you next time. Is this it at the end of all things?